It's the story that's catching the attention of animal lovers and advocates around the world, and you're sure to have an opinion on it too. A woman from Fort Campbell, Kentucky, Jessica Williams, shared on Facebook that she dyes her Great Dane bright pink and purple, and even paints her nails, to help her make look more approachable to strangers. The post has been since removed. Jessica has owned four Great Danes, and notice that people seem to always be intimidated by them simply because of their size, despite their friendly and gentle demeanor. So Jessica came up with a brilliant idea to make her five-month-old dog, Drama, less scary to people. The Kentucky resident said that she was inspired by her dog groomer friend who had recently died her own pup. Jessica decided it was the perfect option for Drama, and bright pink and purple were the colors of choice. She even painted her nails. The mom of one said that as soon as she died her Great Dane puppy, she noticed there was an immediate positive response. People are generally scared of big dogs, and I've noticed that some people might not approach my dog as much as little ones. With them being died, it makes it easier to socialize them, because not nearly as many people are afraid, especially when they're pink and purple. It also means that drama can be the reason someone smiles, and they would be more eager to walk up to us and ask to pet them. And alongside her short pink nails, it makes it clear to people that she isn't going to do them any harm, Jessica posted on Facebook. The dog owner died drama on January 22, 2019. She paid $100 for the shocking transformation. Jessica said that the money spent was well worth it and feels that it allowed drama to be more well accepted when she takes her out in public. She's continued her reasoning on Facebook. Even though drama has only been died once, I definitely am hooked. We make sure that it's safe dye being used on her and she loves the experience. It's like she's having her own spa day. Unfortunately, Drama is colorblind, so she can't see how fabulous she looks, but everyone else definitely thinks she is. As soon as her dye starts to fade, I will definitely be taking her back to the groomers to have it done again. She looks great. Of course, despite the supposed positive reactions, she has received quite a lot of backlash from people who say the treatment is cruel. Most people love it, but others hate it and think she's embarrassed. A lot of people don't realize that the dye being used is really safe. So I make sure I tell everyone that it's safe dye and doesn't harm drama at all. I've had complaints about painting and trimming her nails too, but I always make sure drama is comfortable and a good dog owner should always take care of their pooch's feet. I've even received death threats about the fact that I dye my dog, but in reality, all of my dogs are spoiled more than most adults. What do you think? You can watch the full story in the video below. Jessica is certainly not the only dog owner who has decided to dye their dog in eye-catching colors. Back in July 2018, a woman named Nicole from Ontario, Canada also received great criticism for dyeing her dog Stella on a constant basis, even claiming that her dog becomes somewhat depressed if she's not multicolored. What are your thoughts on dyeing dogs? If the dye is technically safe to use, do you think this should be an issue? I think we can all agree that death threats are way out of line, regardless of your opinion. Please share this with your friends and family.